decade even, uh, institutionalization is very important for companies, but it's uh, a very important process in the society at large. So, uh, what do you think of this process? I think that we are entering into a new phase in the develop development of public relations in contemporary society because all the Western democracies are based on the assumption of an informed citizen. It's only recently, in the past 20 years, that uh, all the rights which we are really institutionalizing public relations function in society are being implemented in the law, like uh, as a right uh, to be informed about major decisions that are concerning your life, including all kinds of interventions into the environment and, and think, uh, things like that. These all forces, actually all institutions, government, companies and NGOs, actually to rethink the way they are carrying the information function, which was previously only seen as a kind of dissemination of information. Now also technology is enabling that all these changes and people are actually demanding to see all kinds of decisions, documents and similar things which are affecting uh, their life. And this again will produce a kind of higher level of participation of citizens in the life of a society at large and this will probably also uh, make uh, public relations actually play a much bigger role than, yeah. than we are used to. Yeah, this is a very important and uh, in a way new point of view mm. from our uh, because uh, uh, it means the, the social role of institutionalization uh, of PR. Uh, and uh, uh, do you, can you add something uh, on this? Well, if you look at the programs that the World Bank, for example, on one right. side, or, or, or the Organizations for Economic Cooperation and Development, yeah. OECD, is doing on the other side, you can see that they are producing a lot of internal documents, or, but also handbooks for external dissemination concerning how should governments and organizations uh, be more concerned with uh, issues that affect good governance, as they call it. And this good governance, which is not only about good governance of governments, but also good governance of big companies, in, in a lot of ways actually is based on some basic principles uh, of public relations, like they are responsible for giving information about uh, their life, they are responsible for opening uh, two-way uh, communication flows with citizens or customers or neighbors or whoever. They are responsible actually in certain uh, programs to actively promote participation so that people can engage in debate uh, with them about what types of programs are, access, are, are acceptable or maybe how to change some of those programs so that they would be uh, more acceptable uh, uh, to them. And I think we will see more and more of that. So this is a very interesting point of view that, that you raised that uh, I hope we will discuss in Milano Congress. Okay. Certainly. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank Thanks. you.